You might not like this method of setting up your emails in Outlook uh, called the Simplified Account Creation feature, uh, which was designed to make it easier for you to uh, set up your email account in Outlook. But it doesn't always work. Sometimes you might find that it doesn't pick up the right settings and you have trouble editing those settings. You might also get um, a message coming up saying we couldn't create the Outlook data file um, or something similar to that, uh, which may cause a problem. This guide shows you how to go back to the good old fashioned method of adding an email account in the latest versions of Outlook, i.e. turning off the simplified account creation feature. First of all, we need to come out of Outlook. So uh, let's just come out there. And then we need to click the start button and we need to type reg edit. Okay, that's reg edit. And then under best match, it should say registry editor desktop app. Left click this once. The screen will darken and it will say, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Make sure that it says registry editor and make sure the verified publisher is Microsoft Windows. Click yes if that's the case and click no if it says anything else. OK, so what we need to do is we need to click on the little arrow just next to HKey current user. Then move down and click the little arrow next to software. Then again, move down and click the little arrow next to Microsoft. Move down again and click the little arrow next to Office. Then move down and click the little arrow next to 16. Now, if you're using a later version of Office than 2019, this might be 17, 18, 19, just depending on what version of Office you're using. But for 2019 or the current Office 365 as of January 19, it's 16. OK, then you move down to Outlook here and click the little arrow just to the left of it. And then find Setup and left click Setup. Then we move our mouse up to Edit up the top there, down to New and then across and down to D Word 32 bit value and left click that once. It comes up with New Value. And we need to type here, capital D, I S A B L E, capital O, F F I C E, 365, capital S, I M P L I F I E D, capital A, C C O U N T, capital C, R E A T. I O N. So it should say a capital D and the rest in lowercase disabled, then Office, capital O in Office, 365, capital S in Simplified, capital A in Account, and capital C in Creation. No spaces between these. Then press Enter or Return on your keyboard. Then double click Disabled Office 365 Simplified Account Creation and change the value data there from 0 to 1. Make sure that the base is hexadecimal, so there's a dot next to hexadecimal. And then move your mouse down to OK and left click once. Then move your mouse up to the cross in the top right hand corner of the registry editor and left click once. Now we open Outlook again and then we click File, and then we click Add Account. And as you'll see, good old familiar Add Account box will appear, and you can go to Manual Setup or Additional Server Types, click Next, and then select your Office server, whether it be POP, IMAP, Office 365, or Exchange Active Sync. Select that, click Next, and obviously fill out the details as provided by your webmaster or mail server. Okay. Hope this guide helps. Thanks for watching.